Hi guys, so here's the third and final Eid special look. And for the last one, I decided to focus on a technique rather than any particular look. Because using this technique, you can create absolutely any colored smoky eye that you want to. So I hope you enjoy and now let's get started. So I'm starting off with my Sigma eyeshadow base in the shade Persuade and I'm applying it all over my lid and up to my brow bone. You can use any eyeshadow base of your choice. Now I'm taking a piece of scotch tape and sticking it on the back of my hand just to get rid of the excess stickiness so that it doesn't tug on my delicate eye area. Then place the tape on your outer corner starting from the end of your lower lash line and going up towards the end of the brow. Then with my Sigma E40 blending brush I'm taking this matte brown shade and applying it on my crease in a windshield wiper motion. Now it really doesn't matter which palette you use so just go ahead with whatever you have. Then with my Sigma E45 small tapered blending brush, I'm taking this matte dark brown and intensifying my crease. Next with the same brush, I'm taking this matte black eyeshadow from my BH 120 eyeshadow palette and putting most of the color in my outer corner. And then with almost nothing on the brush, I'm gonna go over my crease. The idea is to gradually build the color rather than going in with a lot at once. At this stage this is what you should have and from here on you can create absolutely any colored smoky eye that you want to. So today I chose this purple shade and I'm using my Sigma E55 eye shading brush to pack on the color on my lid. Just fill up the empty space that you have and make sure that it is well blended with the other shades. Now if you want to darken the outer corner even more then go ahead with the black shadow again and intensify it according to your preference. Next with this light golden shimmery shade I'm highlighting my inner corner. To highlight my brow bone I'm using this goldeny cream eyeshadow. Then I'm lining my lash line using my Lacme Insta Liquid Eyeliner. Use the scotch tape as a guideline for your wing and also don't forget to outline your inner corner. Now for the fun part, take out the scotch tape and you'll have a sharp clean edge. This technique never fails. Then I'm lining my waterline with a cold pencil. Now if you want you can be done here or you can take any color of your choice and smudge it out under your lower lash line. Here I've taken this green eyeshadow with a small smudge brush and I'm putting it underneath my lower lash line. Now if the scotch tape removed a bit of your foundation, then just apply a bit of powder on that area. To finish everything off, I'm applying my Jordana Best Slash Extreme Volumizing Mascara on both my top and bottom lashes. So here is the final look. I hope this was somewhat helpful to you and you would try this technique out on yourself to create any colorful smoky eye. So until next time, 
टेक केयर एंड ईद मुबारक